hello guys welcome to my channel today we are going to see how to fix kernel a r n e l v p n error that comes while installing the kernel script runner on windows 10 or windows 11 computer so whenever you try to download the kernel and install it you get an error message while installing that says could not connect to the server try using the vpn so while downloading this not able to get or uh, get the option of installing guys let's fix it guys so what you have to do is disable windows security and chrome security browser guys uh, let's do it guys for that go to search menu and type windows security open it Select the virus threat protection and select the manage settings of virus threat protection guys and you just want to select disable all these guys in this page you just want to disable for installing that after installing we can enable it guys on left side you just need to select the firewall network protection guys left side select it and select domain network and select microsoft defender firewall to disable guys turn off for a second after installing it we can turn it on back close out of here guys now you just want to disable the chrome security guys for that open up chrome select the three dot icon and select settings on left side you need to select the privacy security guys on right side you just need to scroll down and get security and scroll down you just need to select uh, the no protection you just need to select this for installing that guys after installing it we can enable it guys the security after doing it close out of here don't need to close out of here guys we just need to close out of here and need to relaunch the chrome guys chrome browser and we just need to download the kernel K K R N L download we just need to download it click here to download click the download latest version now beta click on it and here we started down only guys keep you just need to select the keep option to keep it k or nl beta has been downloaded now you just need to close the browser guys and you just need to next you want, need to enable the vpn in your windows don't go with any kind of extension and vpn extension guys one thing i will recommend you with go with go to open up web browser google chrome and download the p r o t o n vpn proton vpn this is totally free guys i will how to download i will show you guys select the download vpn select the download proton vpn you just want to sign in for to free install guys i already signed in that's why i am getting download select the keep and download it after download it you just want to install it guys and after installing it we get a proton vpn like this we just opened it in you need to connect any servers i am gonna go with the netherland click connect it wait for it after can wait for it guys this is connecting
after get connected guys you just need to go to file explorer and you just need to install the kernel app guys go to downloads and click the krnl beta and double click on it you just want to download install it guys now you can able to see no problems i am getting it you can see right now wait for it now you can see guys your problem has been resolved right now guys you just need to watch my whole video right you do and right means you will get like this you can add a script and do it what you want it and you just want to close out of here and now you just need to re-enable all security and chrome security guys we just go fast in here go security and you just want to enable back in the same thing for google chrome we just uh, disable the protection of google chrome guys virus threat protection you just need to go the manage settings and uh, everything you just need to turn it on this will lock us q turn it on back and left side select the firewall and network protection and you just need to turn on domain network as well click on the domain network and turn it on guys this is going to turn on select the turn on and close out of here the same way go to google chrome and select the three dot icon select the settings and select uh, on left side privacy and security right side select uh, security and we get protection to enhanced protection or standard protection you can able to no protection not recommended guys don't keep this we just installing that that's why we keep that one you just need to select the standard one or enhanced protection after finishing this close off here and your problem has been resolved right now and that's it for today's video guys give me a like and subscribe thank you